Hi, this is Steven Hepler. I wanted to give you some background about how I supervise my drama program. I've been fortunate in having some of the brightest students at Fruitport High School during the past 12 years. We're a really intuitive bunch, and when we read a script, it's easy to see where the action is and where the conflict lies within the scene. We zero in on the emotions that we need to convey to the audience, then we express them using our voices, our faces, and our bodies. One thing I have stressed since the beginning is movement. You always have to give the audience something compelling to look at if you want to keep their attention. Your words aren't enough. So we love stage combat. We love to start a fight in front of the audience. We've done everything from the breakfast scene and the miracle worker to several fencing routines in Cyrano de Bergerac, Romeo and Juliet, North Hanger Abbey, and a few others. We turn up the action, then we turn up the music, and it feels like you're watching a really good adventure movie. We keep it safe, we rehearse it a hundred times so that every move is memorized, and we keep it fun. One thing I always strive for is to give my actors as much input in their scenes as possible. If you're new to the program and you don't know what to do, you'll get all of the advice you need to get you out of that box so you can make your own directions and make the scene real. My advanced actors get very little direction. They've already spent hundreds of hours in after-school rehearsal for plays. They don't need me to tell them what to do. If I have something specific I'd like, I throw it out there and they add it to what they've planned already to put their scene over the top. Simplicity is our friend. Our entire drama curriculum is one sheet of paper. We keep it simple so students can master the basics quickly, then get up on stage and earn an A every time. It's common for our best students to take Drama 1 and Drama 2 classes, then appear in the fall play every single year. We're big on peer evaluation. First, you'll give a performance with your script in your hand, where the whole class chips in on ideas on how you can improve. Then we have a week to rehearse and perfect it. Then comes your final performance with a formal evaluation from me. My drama students work incredibly hard, and they learn so much by working more with each other than they work with me, which is different from most programs. We are more than a team. We are a family. We spend an incredible amount of time together, and the things that we achieve together in our tiny little theater are amazing. I always say that as a drama teacher, I have the best job in the world. I'm a professional storyteller, and that is our job, to always tell the story. <laughs>